Welcome back to CrossCode, my friends. My name is Seeking. I'm gonna keep going with this game. All right, up to the bridge. Oops. Oh yeah, Leah. Just a heads up. Don't worry about the captain being a bit on the grumpy side. That's just the way he is. Uh. All right, if you say so. Cap, I'm back with the report. I see. Go on. The initiation? A total cinch. Here's the avatar, Leia, she's called. Aye, hard to miss that lass. Hope you didn't run into everything with those horns there. W what? Wait, don't tell me you didn't notice the horns till now, Leia. Are you fucking kidding me? I didn't run into them. Anyway, make sure you clean up the mess you started down in the cargo hold soon. Yes, Cap. I hope Sergei is satisfied. Is he around? Yeah, just let me set up your headset for a sec. Hello there, Jet. My good man! Has been a long time. Indeed, you are still clinging to that jetpack, I see. You know I never travel the sea without good old Betty. Anyway, I hope you two will be ready to travel on soon. An avatar on board just calls for damn trouble. Of course, we will make this as brief as possible. Gee, Cap, what kind of welcome is that supposed to be? Also, ain't we talking to Jet, former BRP dueling champ? You keep telling us about all your old, all your combat moves from the old days, so here I thought maybe you'd want to give Leia a small combat lesson. <sighs> You're telling me that little lass is up for a battle? Oh, you bet she is. Right, we'll see about that. You just talk to me later today. Sweet! Now then, you're excused. You can show the lass around the ship, but don't you stir up any trouble. Alright, Captain. Yar, me matey. Come on, Leia, it's time for some fresh air. Whoosh. Nice airlock sound. I just spit all over the place. I'm glad you guys couldn't see that. Ugh. Welcome on board the MS Solar. Seagulls! Oh, that's cool. That's a nice touch. It sounds real, too. That's cool. MS Solar. Quite the ship, huh? Yes! You know, the view here is nice, but you gotta see what's beyond the bow. We're currently steering towards Rhombus Square. That's something to look at. Huh? Actually, why don't we just go to the bow and explain to Leia the situation? Seeing Rhombus Square will make it easier for her to understand, correct? Hey, good thinking, Sergey. Follow me, Leia. Oh, alright. I actually control her now. Can I shoot him? Oh, I wanted to shoot the captain. There she is, the Avatar. Why are you black? And she's a Spheromancer class. How awesome is that? Oh, wait. That's nerds. That's gotta be your first... That gotta be your first fan, Leia. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm the shit now. Hey there, Carla. Good to see you about all these strange... No, that's not nerds. About all these strange boxes. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to clean that up. Right now, I have to take care of the avatar, you know? I'll do it today. Later today, alright? See ya. There she goes again. She said exactly the same thing yesterday. A spiromancer. So awesome. <laughs> Bow is just ahead. It's a bit of a walk, though. Just follow me. Yeah, we're running! For all those destructible boxes doing that room anyway, so I was just practicing how to use those things, you know? Probably should have done that somewhere else. No. Now, girl, have a look at this. That's really good. I like this. Okay, how to start this? How about welcome to Cross Worlds? Uh one step after another, Carla. Leah, do you remember the concept of an MMOG? MM multi Massive multiplayer online game? Uh huh. Alright. Now, Cross Worlds is like an MMO. Just with one striking difference. The world of this game is not virtual, it is real. All players are remotely connected to this world through special avatars. These avatars have a physical shape and tightly connected to all five senses of the player. And you, Leia, are currently logged into this game as well. Uh. What? Me? Oh, me? No, I'm not a player. I just work here. In fact, you're the only avatar on this whole ship. That is right. This cargo ship belongs to the maintenance staff of Crossworlds. The actual game takes place in the land you see over there, the playground. 
The reason you are here, Leia, is because you are not a regular player. You have lost your memory, and we try to receive it again. Huh? You see, you have not been in this game before. Being logged into this game, there's a chance you might remember your past. And that's why we'll try to get you into the real playground soon. Yeah, in fact, you're going. You'll be going to this glass palace of a city over there. Ah, <gasps> me? That's Rumba Square. That's where all players start. This is interesting. Well, I guess it's cleared up some things at least, right? All right then. I think this is a good time to split. I'm gonna go to the captain and help him set up that combat lesson for you. Meanwhile, you can have a look around the ship if you like. The crew knows about you. I guess you already noticed that, right? You can meet me later nearby the captain. Until then, just make sure not to drop into the water, girl. But what if I wanna? What if I want to fall in the water? By the way, Leia, I had a closer look at those speech synchronization issues. I'm afraid I don't think I'll be able to fix those issues soon. God damn it, man. However, I found a little workaround. I might be able to hard code specific audio patterns into your speech module. That means you'll be able to say certain words. <gasps> That should help a bit, correct? So, let's try this out. New word embedded. Hi. 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 It works. I should help you start some conversations with the crew around here. Hi. Hello there, you must be a guest on the ship, right? Why, don't be shy. We seamen. Seamen. May look rough, but we're really, but we're easygoing, folks. Really, you want to know what I'm doing here? No, no. What else? Nothing. Fuck off, man. I don't. Do I have to talk to people, dude? I know you're new around here, but really, you got to be more relaxed about all this, huh? What? Just because I was too quick about cleaning dirty, do we? That wasn't really that much. Well, if you keep this up, people will notice. Before you know it, you'll be, y'all be cleaning the whole deck back to front every day. Uh, I can shoot. Bam. Bam. Woo. Pretty ballerina. Oh, I can only do it so often. Ah, look who's there. You must be that avatar, right? Well, then welcome to the MS Scholar. Scholar. Solar. If you lean over the railing a bit, you might even see the name of the ship. See the name of the ship. Oi, make sure you don't fall into the sea. I'm pretty sure avatars are bad at swimming. I can't jump down there, damn. Hi. Hey, can't you see I'm busy here? Wait, who are you? Alright, I remember now. You're that pseudo-robot thing. Fuck you, man. Oh, no offense. You see, I recently had this discussion with a colleague. It was about an avatar being the same as robots. I have to insist they're not. Avatar just some fragile temporary collection of instant matter. Everybody knows real robots are made of metal like these beauties here. So I can't share the excitement of my colleagues about your presence. You're just an avatar. No true robot, see? Fuck off, mate. Anyway, I have to take care of my babies here, so if you excuse me. Fuck off, mate. Hi. I must say I'm surprised, uh, but uh, lots of beefcake and such. Yeah, over here we have such a cute girl. Oh, she's blushing. Oh, man. Well, fuck you. Some things never change. Fuck off. I'm a pretty little girl. Can't you tell by my highly feminine voice? And my previous pictures, or pictures, previous videos of me using a face cam? Hi. Woo, she can talk now. Gee, calm down there, fellow. Anyway, Carla just passed by us again. She told us that you could take care of all these boxes here. I mean, really? Do you believe this woman? Now she's loading off her work on our guests. Well, she has a point. It's easy to destroy those boxes with your avatar weapons, right? Uh-huh. Awesome, please, I want to see that. No pressure. Da-da-da. So you destroy the boxes first, yes? Yes, show us the balls. Well... You see, I'm a lady in the game. I don't have balls. I have these, which are not balls, but they are balls. Something like that. I don't know. I can't destroy that one? Okay. I guess I won't. Uh, oh, there we go. Or can I destroy them? Hello? Hello? Are they only weak from one side? I knew it. Okay. I was right. They are only weak from one side. Oops. Alright. Back up there. Uh, 
Uh, shit. Um, huh. I did it. I did it. I did it. All cleared. Truly amazing. I'm really surprised how quickly those balls were flying. <laughs> what are you even talking about? I didn't see any balls. Only those boxes disappearing for whatever reason. Yeah, you need to wear these AR goggles to see them. The balls and their impact are all like virtual and stuff. I see. So that's why you've been wearing those goofy glasses all the time. Goofy? You know nothing about style, lady. Anyways, thanks a lot for the help. Yeah. You're welcome. I am Miss Avatar, I guess. Is this? Nothing. Okay. Uh, bridge is where the Capitan is, right? Oh, uh, where are they? I suppose I should ask the guy that I just saw in there about where the Capitan went. Yeah. Oh, Captain, my Captain. Hi. Are you looking for the Captain? I think he's currently somewhere in the cabins. All right. Which cabins? I guess we gotta search for- Fuck! Search for him. You're not the captain. Must defeat respawning enemy. Oh, I thought they canceled this game. No, it's just the old demo. Dang it! Oh well. He seems pretty into the game. We better let him play. I don't know what game that is. I'd like to know. Oh, it's the shower room. Oh, there's nobody showering though. Damn. I mean... Damn. Yeah, yeah, damn. Alright, who are you? My name is the Avatar the Captain told us about. Hi. Free, feel, feel free to check out the ship. I suggest you don't go near the room across. Well, I'm gonna, anyways. Oh, well. Look at this mess. The Captain sure, will surely not like this. Huh? You want to know why? The jet has a strict order around the ship. Every room needs to be cleaned before work. I wonder how these guys manage to skip Jet's daily control visits. Okay. Well, that's interesting. There's nobody in there, so let's go to second floor cabins. It's really like the last place the Capitan could be. Oh, there's nobody in here either. Damn. Hey, I found him! Hi. Oh, you speak. Is your voice finally back? No. Hi. Wait, that ain't right. Her speech... <laughs> that was just adorable, and I don't know why. Her speech synchronization is still malfunctioning. I just hard-coded the word hi into her speech module. It's all she can say for now. I'm currently working on adding more words. I see. It's a beginning, I suppose. Anyways, Cap and I here have been planning out your combat training, girl. We're, all, we're almost set and good to go, right? I this is gonna be interesting. So I'll be off to my cabin for some last preparations. I'll be done in no time, so just stick with the captain, okay? See you later. Okay. I I'll be back at the bridge. You can talk to me when you're ready for the lesson. Make sure you're prepared. I'll be asking for your full attention. You two over there. Make sure you clean up the kitchen after you're done cooking, understand? Aye aye, Captain. Aye, aye, Captain. It's not like you forgot since the last time you told us. Yeah, wasn't that yesterday? Alright. Bridge. Hello. I think this video, this episode is probably boring as shit. But I think I'm going to continue this in the next episode. I'm Again, I've said this before, but I'm wary to make longer episodes because my upload speed is absolute garbage. And sometimes it cuts out. So the longer the episode, the higher of a chance that it'll fail to upload to YouTube for me. So, I apologize everyone. But for now, some of these episodes are going to be boring as shit. I apologize. Anyways, feel free to subscribe if you want to see the next episode when it comes up or anything like that. Or if you just want to. It's up to you. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye I'll see you soon. Have a good one. Bye bye See you later. Ta-ta for now. Whatever.